guys, my name is SCP Gaming. Um, welcome. Uh, here's a, another how-to tutorial. I made a video on how to make a very far-flying paper airplane for 2000, or not, or just a very far-flying paper airplane, um, called the Nakamura, Nakamura Lock or something. That was last year's, uh, uh, world record breaking paper airplane. Now I'm gonna make this year's world record break, re breaking paper airplane. And sadly, this year will be ending in a few days, so I will be able to make next year's, which is 2014's, uh, when I figure out what it is. So, first what you want to do, um, as everybody should do, is, well, before I even start, you need to be very precise with your uh, cr um, creasing and your folds if you want it to fly really good. So, first what you want to do is fold it lengthwise. And make sure that they're the the fold is dead on. And just ignore that. The dog won't be not will not be getting in. And so you just want that to be dead on, and then crease it. So then it should look just like this. Um, then you're gonna unfold it, and then fold it like this. And then fold it literally just right along that line. I have not folded it right, so you want to make sure that it's pointy and these th and these two tips touch. So and if you don't get it uh, right on the first time, uh, don't worry, just keep trying and at some point you will get it. So then it should look just like this. Next, you're going to want to fold it like this. Kind of like it's length, lengthwise like this. Crease it. We'll do the same exact thing on the other side. Make sure that they're touching nice and snug. And then it should your paper airplane should look just like this. And then nice and pointy. Next, what you want to do is the front part of the plane. You want to bend it back right along the line, and then make that tip touch the very back of the line, right here. So you want to make the tip touch right there, and then crease it off at the front. And then, so then it should look like this. Next, what you want to do is you can have these like kind of flaps right here. You want to fold these off. <clears throat> You want to fold them off so that it's like that, and then there's no more like lines. Then you want That's stupid dog. Then you want to fold it back. What's that dog doing? You just want to fold it back like this, and leave about an inch of space between um, the bottom of here and the rest. So you want to fold it so that there's about an inch of space, which is about another length. And then make sure that the line is still just like this. Just straight down the center of the plane. And then you want to fold this off. You want to crease this off again. And then after it's almost like that, you want it to have about another inch of, or about uh, two centimeters of space on this side. And then fold it back. So like about two centimeters and just fold it back. So then it should look just like this. And then what you want to do is don't fold it in like this, fold it outwards like this. So then this thing is on the outside. And I like doing it from the outside right here because then I can just do this and just fold it up to the lines like this. Make sure that the lines are just right. And again, if you don't get it right on the first try, just keep trying and keep practicing and you will get it very soon. Because this took me a while to, com to completely get right. And then after that's done, it should look like this. If this thing is still like sticking out at the bottom, don't worry. You can just uh, kind of push it up if you want. But um, you're not really done yet. Next what you want to do is fold it 
down. So hold on. You want to fold it down from right here up to it. It's like this. And then go on to the other side of the plant and like when you're folding it, make sure that it's not crooked. So then it should look like this. And then do that same exact thing on the other side. And I just like to again just match it up with this side. This, this is kind of like tricky because once it once you get it like that it starts to get stiff. God, I am sweating hot. It's probably because of this light. So it should look like this. Then what you want to do is take these back parts and go and make like a little fold up. And this seems like it's going to be the other side. Like that. Unfold it. Bring these two things up. And it should look like this. Um... What you want to do is, it doesn't matter if it's like kind of crooked like that, just bend the wings up and it should look like this. It doesn't matter if, again, it doesn't matter if it's like crooked like this, it, it's kind of meant to be like that. Then um, take the back of the wing and just kind of pinch it and bend it up a tiny bit, and then you're all set. So basically, that's all you have to do. That's the 2013 World Record Breaking Paper Airplane. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye-bye.